Ryan McCaffrey from Calgary in Canada. You said you came out of semi-retirement for Heartbeat of Home. Yeah, I guess what so. What is the story? Um, I was in Riverdance for many years, right. and I took a break for about almost, I guess, six years, maybe almost seven. And wow. uh, I got the call from Heartbeat a few weeks ago, and uh, just decided I couldn't pass up the opportunity. Do you mind me asking, what were you doing for the six years you were out of Riverdance? I went to university. Right. And, uh, I graduated with my degree, and okay. I was just working. So I actually got a job in social media. Right. I was sort of the digital um, digital guy at an agency, so okay. to do all the digital marketing for clients. And did you keep on the dancing? Did you keep on dancing? Yeah, like always a little bit teaching, sort okay. of here and there. Not to the same degree of what we're doing here. Yeah. Uh, but once you become a dancer and you've been doing it for many years, it's very hard to stop 100%. So Of course. Yeah. So this requires an obscene level of fitness, and yes. river dance requires an obscene level yes. of fitness. So yeah. are you also hitting the gym while you're doing heartbeat and stuff? As soon as I got the call, right, uh, and or as soon as I said yes, I guess is uh, I, I hit the gym. Hardcore, yeah. Right. Okay. <laughs> I up the up the gym appointments for sure, and um, I tried to get as fit as I could within the amount of time that I had. So, are there is there anybody new to, to you down on the floor? Are you uh, working with anybody? They're all actually, yeah, I've heard about a lot of people. The Irish dance community is very small, so everyone's yep. sort of one degree of separation okay. from somebody else. So yeah, I've heard of a lot of, uh, or all of the people downstairs, but um, we're all getting to know each other very well right now. So they're all great, great people. Very good. Yeah. And a lot of you have said this is very intensive. It's day two. I mean, are you getting, are you getting work done? Do you feel like... Yeah. I feel like these, the rehearsals will be very efficient. Um, and yeah, we're sort of, we put together almost one full number, okay. uh, which is a cappella, so we're going quite quickly, which is good. Great. Yeah. Yeah. And getting along with choreographers and people shouting at you course, and yeah, all yeah, of that yeah, kind of yeah. stuff. Yeah, we have John Carey, who's, who's an amazing choreographer, so he knows exactly what he's doing yep. and uh, what looks good and what doesn't. So Great. And having come from spending so long with Riverdance and now kind of getting to know Heartbeat slowly but surely, are you excited about the show? Well, the, I have no idea what to expect. But from the little bits I've heard here and there, and we've seen sort of a little bit of what the set's going to look like, or the background and everything, I think it's going to be absolutely amazing. Brilliant. Yeah. Um, advice for people at home who would love to get to where you are eventually with their Irish dancing or whatever. You know, it's an old cliche, but it really is the truth. Practice does make perfect. So okay. sometimes you just don't want to do it, but you can't get lazy. You have to keep practicing and do it, especially when you don't want to do it. And for Irish dancers, always practice the left foot mm -hmm. more than you practice the right, because that's always the harder one. <laughs> okay. Listen, thank you very much for your time and best of luck with it. Yeah, you're Cheers. welcome.